me out tonight, I'd like you all to give a warm welcome and a big round of applause for your host of the evening, Mr. Jonathan Ross. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, Hello. Good to see you. First thing tonight, what I'd like you to do, pick out a beautiful, glamorous assistant for us. Beautiful, Make glamorous. us look good. Just so pick up someone. <laughs> You're all so attractive. <laughs> I can't really tell. I'm going to... Who would like to do it? Which of the ladies here would like to do it? You put a hand up. Put your hand up. There's a few. OK, let's go. I'm going to put that first hand up on this lady here. What's your name, by the way? Julia. Oh. OK, it's Julia, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Thank you, Julia. I hope it's OK. Thank you, Julia. Thank you. Let's come around and have a seat. Do you need me anymore? Have a seat. OK. OK, guys. So tonight, you notice I've got a few things in front of you. Yeah. First off, what any magician will always carry them couple of decks of cards. Second object, um, actually a friend told me to bring this tonight. They said it's um, really good at falling pen and teller, so I actually uh, brought an envelope tonight. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but inside that envelope is um, one prediction, and I'm not going to touch the envelope. I'm not going to open it. Last object, there's no real reason for it other than in case they say I don't fool them. It's okay. a knife. <laughs> first things first tonight, let's um, take the knife. We'll leave it out there. OK? So that way, if I try to get into that envelope, you're going to see it. Now, ladies first, what I'd like you to do, pick a deck, red or blue? I want the red. OK. What we're going to do with the red deck, OK? Let me just uh, show you as well the cards, just so you can verify this. All the cards are different. Yes. OK? What I want to do is um, take out a card, but I don't want you to look at it. I just want you to lay it face down, so that way I can't see it, you can't see it. Just reach in. Whenever Take one out. Yep, whenever you want. <laughs> okay, just place it face down. Okay, and what I do, I put these back just so I can't make any sneaky switches or anything like that. Okay, so that's Julia's prediction, guys. Okay, I'm not going to touch that. Is that fair? It's great. So Jonathan, <laughs> yes, sir. Blue deck of cards. Lovely. Okay, as you can see again, all different here. All, all different cards. Hold okay. back. Brilliant. We're we'll sticking back in here. What I like you to do. Let's pick any number between 1 and 52. OK, uh, OK. What is it? Well... <laughs> I'm not that good. <laughs> you, want, you want to tell Yeah, me? tell me. Do you want to tell everyone? Tell everyone. Seven. Seven. There's no possible way I could know that you was going to pick seven tonight. I don't think so. OK. And, you know, all the cards here are different. You saw that at the beginning. I saw they were all. It's a whole yep, pack of it's, cards. Um, oh, Mr. Cobble there. Yeah, what yeah. I want to do is just count down seven cards for me. From okay. the top, yeah? Yeah, we do it from the top, that's fine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And just lay the seventh card there for me. This one here, yeah? Yep. Okay, okay you could have picked any number uh, from one to 52. You could have said one, you could have said ten, anything. There's no way I was going to know you were going to pick seven. No. Okay? Now, you could have taken a card from anywhere you wanted. You got to see they're all different. That's right. Is that fair? Yeah, I think so. I yeah, can't okay. answer no Julia, what we need to do is just now turn over your card, have a look. Shout right up to the audience, guys. Show your card. <laughs> okay. Now, you guys could have picked... As I said, it's quite weird. You've picked from anywhere you like. So you could have picked any number. Yeah. And I made one prediction before we came out tonight. And inside this envelope, just so you can see, it's one card. Let's hear it for Julia, ladies and gentlemen.